Wasatch SoftRip's variable data printing option helps streamline the production of customized print runs such as labels, signs, jerseys, promotional items, and more. Change text or images over a base graphic in a process that is both quick and easy. Use SoftRip's auto data feature or import data from a comma delimited file. And customize variable data fields with fonts, barcodes, QR codes, data matrix codes, and a variety of sizing, color, and effect options. To start a variable data project, select File Browser and drag an image into the job screen. Select Variable from the main menu. To designate a variable data field, draw a marquee over an area of the base graphic where the data should be displayed. When the Data Field Properties menu opens, enter a name for the variable data field. Select the font you would like to use from the Wasatch Font or Systems Font drop-down menu. You can choose to have the text automatically shrink or expand to fit the bounding box. Adjust other settings, such as horizontal and vertical alignment. Change the color of the font. When all your adjustments have been made, click OK. To prepare another variable data field, draw another marquee. In this field, we will use a barcode font. SoftRip's variable data printing option offers a multitude of commonly used barcode reduction fonts and barcode fonts. Draw another marquee. In this field, we will use a QR code. SoftRip's variable data printing option allows users to configure QR and data matrix codes. Importing a database is a simple process. Select the Import Database button or select Import Database from the Database drop-down menu. Choose your database and click OK. Your fields are now populated with data. To create a preview, simply select and click the Preview button. When your jobs are ready, open a print menu and choose to add your job to the RIP queue rip your job, rip and print your job, or select Fast Layout. The Fast Layout tool is used for quickly producing layouts for long runs of variable data printing jobs. You can choose to print all records or print a selected range of records. You can also choose to delete files after printing to save hard drive space, suppress annotations, and create preview images. When all of your adjustments have been made, click OK to start processing your job.